Hi everyone. Today we are going to discuss about uh, another one over voltage protection circuit by using NPN transistor. Let us discuss about the working principle of this circuit. Here we are using the input source as a PWL signal from 0 to 12 volt with the time interval of 0 to 200 millisecond. Here the resistor R1 is the biasing resistor or driving resistor for the transistor Q1 and R3 collector resistor for the transistor Q1. Here the collector terminal of the transistor Q1 is connected to the base terminal of the transistor Q2 and uh, the resistor R1 is connected to the collector terminal of the transistor Q2 and uh, we can consider the resistor R4 as a load resistor and uh, now we will discuss how this circuit works against the over voltage and how it will go into protect the load or external circuit with the over voltage. If you see here the voltage V1 act as a source voltage and uh, resistor R1 and R2 as a voltage divider and it will drive the base of the transistor Q1. Here we are considering base to emitter voltage of the transistor Q1 will be VBE as 0 0.7 volt and uh, similarly for the Q2 transistor also. So that the transistor Q1 will turn on only when the base to emitter voltage crosses or more than the 0 0.7 volt. By considering the resistor R2, here we are considering the less value with the 650 ohm. Due to this, at the lower input voltage, most of the voltage will be dropped across the resistor R1 and the base voltage will be less than 0 0.7 volt. If we goes on increase the input supply and at the some point voltage across the resistance R2 will be more than 0 0.7 volt. Once the base voltage crosses 0 0.7 volt, the transistor Q1 will get on and it will start conducting. And at the same time, the current flowing from the collector to emitter terminal of the transistor Q1 and passes it to the ground and it will maintain the collector voltage of the transistor Q2 will be very less around 0 0.2 volt that means the transistor Q2 will be turned off because the base voltage of the transistor the driving voltage of the transistor will be less than 0 0.7. When the base voltage is less than base to emitter voltage, Vb is less than Vbe, Q2 will off. At the same time, the current will flowing through the resistor R4 will turn 0. In this way, our voltage protection circuit helps against the over voltage to the external circuit or the load. Let us simulate the circuit. Here we are considering this as input voltage. It will start from 0 volt to 12 volt with the time interval of 0 millisecond to 200 millisecond. And at certain point, current across the load will drop to 0. Let us verify here. See, if I consider this circuit, our load current will drop to zero at 10.883 volt. And uh, 
this point we can call as threshold point of the this circuit here the resistor r1 play the important role to control the threshold point and the resistor r1 is directly proportional to the threshold voltage that means if we increases the resistance value of the r1 the current will cut off at some more threshold point let us verify. Here I am considering around 10.5 kilo ohm resistance as a R1. So I am going to run this circuit. See, our threshold point will get increases. Okay, around 7.4 volt. Similarly, if I reduce us to 9 kilo ohm, our Threshold point will be going to reduce. See? This is around 9.8 volt. Hope you are understand from this circuit how we can utilize the NPN transistor as a over voltage protection circuit. And uh, how to control the load current by using the base resistance of the transistor Q1. I request you to kindly subscribe and like the video. Thank you. Thank you for the watching.